Hello there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. So in this video, I'm gonna teach you how to use perplexity like a pro. Now before we get into it, what is basically perplexity? Now as you can see right here, it is like ChatGPT, but for me, better. So just rather than searching for Google, YouTube, and any other social media platforms, perplexity has it all. So let's try it right here. So again guys, this should be the landing page you should be seeing on your end. And by the way guys, there is a new feature that says Pro. So Pro showed basically our most powerful search, ideal for longer answers to complex questions. So Pro search is basically for the paid subscriptions, but we have 5 searches per day, refreshes, or reloads every 4 hours. Right now, I'm going to make a video for a free trial so the general audience can also um, try it out. Now before we get started in this one, I want to show you the paid prices for this one. And now this is going to be the pricing for Reflexity. We have the free standard, or basically the professional. Professional is $200 per monthly. We have unlimited quick searches. 600 pro searches per day that refreshes also every 4 hours. So you can select your preferred AI model. So from ChatGPT 4.0, Claude, Sonar, and more. You can upload and analyze unlimited files. You can visualize and basically get $5 per month in API credits. So let's try that with this one. How powerful basically is perplexity? I'm going to make sure I enter pro there so we can have some fun here. And you'll notice on the bottom we have focus. So focus is basically you can choose from all academic, writing, math, video, and social. Now with this one, I'm going to go for all first. And with this one, I can also attach some files. But I'm going to do this later in the video. So please stay until the end, okay? If I pull up my notepad right here, I have some set of questions to really test the power of perplexity. So with this one, I have a question, Kling AI, what it is and what does it do? Is it better than Sora AI? Let me just fix that one. Just making sure I have the all focus here. And I think I'm good with this one. Simply click on that one or enter. Now, as you can see, this is for pro search. Since this is a free trial, I know we have four pro searches left. And as you can see right here, it is currently reading on YouTube. We have the sources. We also have some thumbnails on the right side. That's why I told you guys that this is better. Personally for me, rather than Google, rather than spending your time looking for everything there, if you use perplexity, it will give you a very comprehensive answer. You have sources, you have the answer, you have the description. There is also a comparison, there is also a table here for the feature Kling and Sora, which is going to be the benchmark. And the current status also for recent digest or recent events. And of course, guys, you can rewrite. For example, if you're satisfied with your answer, you can rewrite it here. You can share it also. And you have your link right there. And you can share it with your friends and families. For the three dots right there, you can view sources or just simply choose on the sources right there. Same drill. You can also click on copy for everything in here. Or basically, you can edit your query or your question. There is also some related questions that builds up based on your question. Now speaking of building up or following up on your question, we can ask a follow-up question with this one. Think of it as just talking to a person or talking to an AI basically. I can now ask it or ask it or here. It is a safe tool to use. I'm gonna click on that one. And as you can see, I'm still asking about the um this one, the Kling AI. This is not an entirely new topic. It understands that I am asking on the previous topic. And as you can see right here, access safety of using Kling AI, these are the sources. The potential risk benefits conclusion also. And with this one, let's try checking on the sources. Now welcome back to the video. As you can see right here, this is a very good sources, which is used on Perplexity AI. Now going back on Perplexity, now we're here back on Perplexity. Since I already showed you the basic or the power of the proxy um, all search, I want to show you right now the image generation tool. You heard me right, there is an image feature or image generation feature in perplexity. It's not like Midjourney or any other paid um, image generation tool out there, but it's still the works. So we have search image, search videos, and generate image right there. However, for generate images with Pro, you're going to need the paid version. But there is a workaround for this one. I want to try this uh, very simple prompt. So create a highly detailed image of a colorful snake. Now with this one, it's currently searching for an um, image right here. 
and let's wait for it to finish. I'll get back to you once it's here. Now welcome back to the video. Right now we have this awesome um result regarding a crawl for snake. However, I know that it's not that good compared with mid journey or other paid subscription. So I highly check or highly encourage you to check my video on mid journey. I also have it, so please check it out. Anyway, I only show you that it has a feature for generating images. Now, once you're satisfied with everything, for example, you want to restart your um conversation, go back on home right there, and basically go from the beginning. If I check, I still have two searches left today, and I'm gonna try the focus here. Now, before I try the focus, I have a specific question. So how to lose weight? And with this one, I'm gonna go for all. Click on that one. And it's just basically another topic I wanna tackle. And I'll show you the power of perplexity. As you can see right here, searching for general late was tips, I have to summarize the key weight Celeste Religion found. Now, I don't need a trainer here. I don't need to pay um, hundreds of dollars to pay uh, some physical trainer. I can just follow this one. As you can see, to effectively lose weight, you need to make commitment, assert your current situation, set goals, up to manage stress and sleep. And with that one, it is also now a very comprehensive guide on how to lose weight. We also have some sources right here. If you dig, dig this one, the drop down icon, each of the topic that was tackled here has its very own sources, as you can see right there. It's a very detailed answer comparing with ChatGPT or Claude. That's why I really like perplexity. Now let's try the limits here just more, going back on home. Let's focus on writing here. Or let's just go for academic. Because for academic, I have a very specific question. So the influence of the greenhouse effect. So it's academic for you guys. Click an answer. And now it only focuses as an academic answer for papers, thesis, or report answers. And now as you can see right here, we also have some images, some visual aids to support our inquiry. With this one, we have the sources. This is the answer. And basically, it's a really good one. Take note. It has sources right there or citations because again this is an academic focus taking about that one okay it's not just a general all focus it's basically an academic one that's why it has citations now going back on the home button we still have some more things to try on so please stay until the end now welcome back to the video with this one i tried creating a diagram of seven wonders of the world but it only gave me a code so you can use this code on your Python, on your PowerPoint, and it works. However, there is also a way here to create diagram in perplexity. If you click on generate image, as you can see, this is a paid version. However, I have prepared a screenshot on how it looks like. Let me just pull it in. And with this one, if you click on generate image, as you can see right there, there is an option for diagram, even illustration, painting, and photograph. But again, guys, this is the paid version, and I'm only focusing on the free trial as of now. I'm going to create a video for a paid version in the near future, so please check out that one. Now, welcome back to the video. So, Perplexity also have a discover page. This is actually new now. now. With this one, it's basically the recent news, the most updated news all around the world. It differs from pages to pages. For example, this one right here was created on a single platform. Same goes with this one. It's a different page created by a single individual. Now with this one, you can create your own page, much like this one. If I click on this specific person of this specific page, it created its own one. For example, this perplexity team, it has created its own very own page. You can also share the page right there, or you can also basically copy the link. Of course, you can create your very own by going to library, but there should be a plus icon there that creates your own page. However, that is still not being rolled out to the public all around. It's still being slowly delivered one by one in each region. However, I have a screenshot and how to look like. So basically, as you can see right there, there's a plus icon and there should be a page icon right there. Now, if you click on page, it should look like this. So what is your page about? Just enter what is your page about. For example, you want Silicon Valley events. If you enter Silicon Valley events, Perplexity AI will create your page for you. All you need to do is upload your background image and you'll be good to go. Now speaking about the paid subscription, since this is actually a little bit on the paid subscription for the page, if you click on settings right here, you can also change your very own AI model. As you can see right there, my one is default, because actually this is also for paid subscription. However, if I click on this one, as you can see right there, I have a screenshot on how it should look like. 
for your different language model. They also have Sonar, Large 32K, or even GPT-4. Easy as that. Again guys, if you want to change your AI model, go to settings and under Perplexity Pro, which is the base subscription, you can change your AI model. Pretty awesome, right? Now going back on library, you can also create your own collections. For example, vacation planning with this one, and then choose an emoji. For the sake of the discussion, description, Europe, something like that, and AI prompts. For example, you are a travel agent, help me plan my trip to Europe, something like this one. If I click on create right now, it's now creating a vacation plan for me. And if I click on this one, it's now basically a prompt where I can now collect all of my findings, all of my locations, and all of my um, chat with perplexity. So if I'm now going to Europe, I can simply open this collection and read whatever I have planned. Easy as that. And now speaking for a little bit more advanced features, we have Perplexity Labs. Let me just go to it right now. Now under Perplexity Labs, this is the link labs.perplexity.ai, but this is more on the encoding level. Not everyone will use this one, of course. It has its own AI models right here. Sonar, we have Instruct, Gamma, Mixtral, and so much more. But for this one, I have a specific um, prompt with this one. I'm going to go for Python. So create a Python script on um, how to scrape on data for a website. So if you click on enter right there, it's currently creating me a Python script. Easy as that. So we think of it as a very powerful assistant where you can do anything. So you can just test the water first if you don't like to try the paid version as of now, because the free trial is pretty awesome. That being said, this is all for now. So thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Goodbye for now.